So I really want to express that even though depth can work for those that want to just copy and paste between hundreds of layouts, even if you um, just say, you know what, that's cool, there's all these layouts, I want to just be able to do my own thing and um, just kind of create my own uh, layouts, depth definitely has all the settings needed for you to um, powerfully create your own um, layouts. And I just want to kind of give you an example of uh, what I mean by that. Already in the background, um, here's where I've added my uh, transparent PNG image of the phone. I get to say um, the size, you could either set it to be the natural size of what you add, or you can have the phone um, cover, which if you're dealing with product images, I would never say cover. Contain is not a bad one for product images, but if you wanna get that sizing right, or if you wanna get it exact, there's something called custom here. So you're setting the width, the height, the, uh, and the X and Y position. And this accepts pure CSS values. You can even see where it says CSS right here. So that's crazy <laughs> right there. You get extreme control over what the background image is doing. Either you're dealing with just a large image and you just want it to fill the background, that's easy. Or you're dealing with product images and you want it to compose a very particular way on a uh, on a section. Uh, so then you um, can then after that you have grading controls whether you want to go um, you know left to right or if you want to go from top to bottom. Here's your gradient colors. We want some kind of like blue tint in the background and see how that tint right there uh, is now in the background. If I uh, adjust the opacity of that tint to like a light blue. And then let's say I wanted the tint to be over everything. Um, there we go. Now we have a blue tint to everything. But then we say, oh, I want my background image to pop out the most. Well, boom, now the background image is of the phones is foremost. Or if we say, you know what, I want that gradient that I made, I want that to be over the phone. Well, there we have it right there. And the gradient is good because now we are letting our text underneath that gradient kind of, um, Oh, be more legible and you can increase the strength of that gradient. Or if you want the tint to just be over everything and you want to kind of make like a washed out effect, we can do that too. Obviously we would never use blue um, for a washed out tint, but who knows? It's kind of cool. Take these controls and push them to the limits, make really creative things and go beyond the layouts that I've made. I can't think of a better any other like mixing of stacks out there right now that would give you the level of control that you're going to get for making site sections. If you're an advanced user, you're going to be very, very happy.